Good morning, everyone. I wanted to tell you a little bit about two projects that we're doing in the Student Affairs Office. The first project is in conjunction with the Wayne County Executive Office, and this is for a Valentine's Day project. One of our former employees here, Lisa Whitmore Davis, who many of you may remember was our development director, is now Director of Senior Services at Wayne County. She's in charge of the Meals on Wheels program, among other things. And she wanted to implement a little bit of care to go with each Meals on Wheels during Valentine's week. And so what we're doing is helping by developing some very beautiful, creative Valentines. And so this project is called Have a Heart, Give a Heart. And what we're doing uh, in our building is we're going to have media day on February 5th where um, various media uh, outlets will be here to film us in action making valentines. So do you have the creative child in you? Do you like to draw hearts? We've gotten a, a good start on some of them so if you're not really creative we can let you just make your message on the ones that we've already created. Or if you're really creative and you want to just go for it, we'll have all kinds of supplies so you can make Valentine's for the seniors. And what the goal is for Wayne County is 5,000 Valentine's. No, Eugene Applebaum College of Pharmacy and Health Sciences is not doing all 5,000, but we hope to do 500 to 1,000, and that's if one person does one Valentine. So that's the first project I wanted to tell you about. The second project that we're working on in student affairs is to use Zoom technology as part of our information meeting, our monthly information meeting, which we usually hold on the first Tuesday of each month. Uh, what we have planned to do is six months out of the year to use Zoom technology and deliver our information meetings through that platform. What that means is instead of students and faculty having to come here to the building on six o'clock first Tuesday of the month they will just sign in to a zoom conference room in the comforts of their own home so we'll have more details and more marketing about this as time goes on but one thing that this will allow us to do is to perhaps reach out to that market of online students who we're trying to attract and they'll be able to come to the monthly information meetings via zoom technology so if you have any questions about either this or the Valentine Project, staff members, my ASO staff are in the audience and they'll be glad to answer your questions. Have a great day.